Western Mass News is your local sports authority. UMass men's basketball is coming to downtown Springfield this weekend. Western Mass News reporter Matt Satilli stopped by practice today to preview the big game. I hope our fans are as excited as I am about our players. I, they're starting to show up. We had a good showing in New York. We had a really good showing against Lowell. Uh, I hope our fans in Western Mass show up there in Springfield. Ten games into the Frank Martin era, the UMass men's basketball team is starting to find their groove and capturing the attention of fans in Western Mass and beyond. It just feels good, you know, to, to be winning and, you know, um, just competing at a really high level. Um, obviously, you know, in, in practice and in the weight room, things have been a lot more intense. On Saturday, Noah Fernandez and his teammates will compete at the Mass Mutual Center in downtown Springfield against the University of North Texas in the 2022 Basketball Hall of Fame Classic. They're an established championship caliber program. It's a team that, that two years ago in the NCAA tournament knocked off Purdue, who was one of the, the teams that was picked to, to win the whole thing. Massachusetts native Wildens Levesque, who also played under Frank Barton at South Carolina, tells Western Mass News the Minutemen style of basketball is built on defense and not backing down. We're trying to build a culture around toughness, you know, everyone being tough and having to do, everyone doing their job, being the best at what they do. And they battled through their own adversity, including a fiery speech from Martin after last week's win over UAlbany, calling out the team's discipline and effort. When I sense that we're acting differently than the way good teams and good players act, it's my job to, to motivate, to push, to prod, pull. But there's only one way to learn, and that's going through it, and that's what we're going through right now. But they'll keep fighting and hope to have the sixth man rooting them on this weekend. Little by little, we're starting to build our fan base again, and our guys take a lot of pride in it, and I can't wait for Saturday. Saturday to play in Springfield. Man, we should come out and support UMass is back. Saturday afternoon's game tips off at 3 o'clock. For ticket information, head to our website, westernmassnews.com. Reporting in Springfield, Matt Satilli, Western Mass News.